Action News Now Storm Tracker Weather. Coverage you can count on. Welcome back. The weather guy, an important guy this time of year, and very important when we have storms. Chris tracking those storms, and the next one on the way, right, Chris? Yeah, we've got another one coming our way Saturday. So if you have plans to do something outside this weekend, Sunday's the outdoor day, Sun Saturday's the the movie or chores or whatever you want to do indoor. Not the chores. Yeah, okay, <laughs> <laughs> my bad. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, Saturday is your indoor uh, uh, hanging out and, and, and main board games or something like that game day. All right, here's what we have going on right now across the region. Not much. A uh, few scattered showers near the north coast, but the rest of us in the north state were dry. These will not make it into our neck of the woods, so we're pretty quiet out there. That's good to see for a change. Temperatures at the moment sitting at the low 50s in the valley. Mountains 40s and 30s for current temperatures down to freezing. In Chester, uh, watch the roadways there in Chester. Watch the roadways in a lot of mountain areas where there's been snow on the ground. Some of that snow melted today. Now we're back to freezing and we're heading down below freezing, so we should have some areas of black ice up there in some of those mountain locations. Watch that later on tonight. Boy, it's been a wet month. Here we are the last day of February. How much rain have we seen this month? Oh boy. 12.15 inches of rain in Chico for the month of February. That is the second wettest February ever. For us, that is a tremendous number for, for the uh, month of February. Normally, we're just about four and a half inches of rain, but boy, we, we almost tripled it. My gosh. Uh, Redding, pretty good number as well. Uh, certainly above average, but not quite as, as crazy above average as Chico was. But everybody got a lot of rain, a lot of snow. Uh, uh, boy, Sugar Bowl, or not Sugar Bowl, Squaw Valley reported their snowiest month ever, not just their snowiest February, their snowiest month ever this uh, month. And I believe Sierra Tahoe Ski Resort in South Lake Tahoe, I think they did the same thing as well. They know they were close and they had more snow yesterday. All right, as far as what we have coming our way tomorrow. Partly cloudy skies and a dry start to the month of March. 42 at 8 in the morning, 53 at noontime. Highs in the upper 50s and then back down to the mid 50s at 5 o'clock tomorrow. So dry again tomorrow. Not Saturday though. Rain comes on in. Not a huge storm system. More rain in the forecast next week. So we just got to keep churning it out there basically. Quiet across the area right now. Tracking stormy weather down to the south of us. That's our next weather maker and Futurecast will bring it on in in the next few days. Not tomorrow though. Tomorrow we're dry, partly cloudy. It should be a nice afternoon. But again, down to the southwest of us, there's that moisture lurking. And here it comes on Saturday, Saturday morning. Here it comes moving on in. Not a huge storm system. We'll get a tenth to maybe two tenths of an inch of rain, and it might even be done by the later parts of the afternoon. So not a whopper, but we do have rain in our Saturday forecast. Tomorrow in Trinity and Siskiyou counties, highs in the 40s under partly cloudy skies. High temperatures in the 40s in the Sierra and the Cascades as well, and 45 tomorrow in Bernie. On the ridge, we'll find high temperatures mid 40s in Sterling City, low 50s elsewhere, including 54 in Paradise tomorrow. Partly cloudy in the north end of the valley, dry, low temperatures close to 40. Tomorrow, partly cloudy again, high temperatures in the upper 50s. In the mid valley, partly cloudy overnight, low temperatures in the lower 40s. Tomorrow, a mix of sun and clouds and high temperatures in the upper 50s, light winds. All right, your Storm Tracker 7 day forecast. The weekend is always in view. Rain is back on Saturday. Again, not a huge storm, a tenth of an inch of rain, maybe two tenths of an inch of rain. So we'll get a few hours of rain, and that should be about it. And then Sunday and Monday, dry again. Next week, here comes rain, Tuesday and Wednesday, moving back on. And that's a little bit of a bigger storm, but still not nearly as big as the storm we just finished up with. All right, which is good. Yes, Don't want is. that right no, now. We'll get it done with that for a while. Yeah, all right. Well, Mark Blaine is here now to speak.